It's going to be a good day. I'm excited to be here, to be a part of this, to witness it. Things are hard to say. The emotions is overwhelming right now. So I'll play a quick song, then we'll get to going. Fire for me is a ceremonial thing. It cleans and cleanses rather than destroys. I've been wanting this for a long time to be a part of these burns up here. And I'm really happy to see the Klamath tribe engaged in this way. I'm really thankful for the fire and that people are seeing fire in a different way. Our ancestors, we were burners. We took care of the land that we were stewards over and they took it away, and so we're born into a sick forest. For me, putting the fire back on the ground, it's exciting. We have been partnering with the Klamath tribes here at Saikan for over 20 years. We had some tribal members come out to some of our prescribed burns starting in 2017 as observers. On one of those burns, some of those tribal members expressed an interest in burning with us. That sparked an idea, which was we should partner together to do that work. Two weeks ago, we got to provide basic fire training for nine of the folks working for the tribal government. Yeah, Kevin, swinging. Learning about engines, learning about fuels, learning about fire behavior, firing devices. Fast forward to today, we're out here to do a prescribed burn and take those skills and put them on the ground through live fire training. Lighting the fire with 50 other firefighters standing around, the feeling in my heart and the thought in my mind was for the people, you know, and for, for our watershed. It's more than just the trees and the ground, it's the water, the wildlife, everything comes into play. I used to log and thin and stuff, and this job opportunity gave me another outlet. It feels more important because I'm working with my own people and I'm working on our own land. I just came in and was just hoping to learn a little bit. I didn't know it would actually turn into like a job, so I especially appreciate the opportunity to be one of the tribal members to participate in the project from the beginning. So when I'm out here walking, it just feels great. These trees are happy. When there's not too many of them, I get excited about things like this. That's a big impact on the earth here. The Nature Conservancy doesn't just view prescribed fire as an anti-wildfire mitigation measure. It's so much more than that. The big opportunity is reconnecting people with fire. So much of the challenges that we have in the West are because we've broken that connection. I still am going to process this, what it really means to me, how it affects not only me, but the future generations. Your children are going to see what was done for them. Still, I, I can't explain the, the feeling that I have about us being out here, finally putting fire on the ground. Long journey coming to the point that we are now, just the start of something bigger now. <laughs>